Hi, my name is Alec Graven with my new book, How to Talk to Girls. I wanted to write this book because boys have a lot of trouble with crushes, and I wanted to help the boys with crushes, but I also wanted to get say that um, there's a girl for every boy, and that um, don't give up, and don't think girls are gross, but um, like they are girls. What's wrong with them? It's very important to have crushes because um, if there wasn't crushes, we wouldn't, um, nothing really would happen and girls and boys would just be separate for life. Some of the things you should do is you can't be goofy. Um, you have to control your hyperness. Cut down the sugar if you have to because unless the girl is hyper and that's pretty rare, um, that um, you won't get a good start if you're hyper. So um, also, you, this is a really important tip. Make sure the boy, you have a friend that doesn't try to take the girl you like because you know how friends tell each other um, like secrets and stuff? Well, if you told them about your crush, they could either blab it to the whole world or they could um, get in to the girl's secrets and what they like and then they swipe the girl and take her away and you're like, um, where do you go? You kind of want to stick out a little, but don't stick out too much. Because if you stick out too much, you could get the wrong girl. Or you could get, um, or if you stick out too little, then you don't get anyone. But if you stick out just the right amount, the, the girl might come to you. And then that's when you, if she, um, like if she's walking past you, you could say, uh, like, hey, did you see that episode of, and then say that. Or you could, if you're brave enough, you could walk up to the girl and say hi. And then the girl says hi, bye. If a girl says hi back, then um, you're off to a really good start. You give a lot of compliments though, but if you give too much compliments, it'll look like you're trying too hard to get the girl to like her and she might think, why is this boy giving me so much compliments? And then she might figure out that like you love her because your secret is to make sure no one finds out that you love her. Gifts, I don't think gifts are, like if you went up to, um, if you went into elementary school and you're like, here, I got these for you, it's too suspicious they're going to be like, that boy likes it. You like her, and that's kind of what it gets into, and then the girl will ditch you. If your crush doesn't work out, then you have to be able to get over it. Because if you can't, it'll sure to ruin your life and it'll like haunt you forever. And then you'll be like, oh, I'm terrible, I'm horrible. And this is just things like you could go from like, you could go from A's to C's because you just don't have confidence. And then like it could lead to a lot of problems just over one girl. So you have to, um, like I always say, life is hard, move on. You have to get over it. When I had to move, I had a girlfriend um, way, way back when I was in Seattle. And then when we had to move, it was, um, I kind of know how they kind of feel. But um, I got over it, and they have to learn how to get over it, because otherwise it would surely ruin your life. Once you get a girl to like you, you have to start you have to keep doing all these things that I just mentioned in the book. Like be friendly, be clean, control your hyperness, do all that stuff. And then if you keep going on that, um, you, you'll have successful and then you could keep her till middle school and possibly till high school. And that's when you start taking her out to dates and everything. And then who knows, you could get married.